Before we jump into the review here, guys, I do need to disclose that I was given this air mattress for free in return for an honest and fair review. So I'm gonna do my best. Now you guys know that I love camping and I love doing gear reviews. So when this company Umbrado reached out to me and asked me to do a review of their truck air mattress, I wholeheartedly agreed. I've been curious about these truck air mattresses for a while now. I thought this would be a good opportunity to try one out and do a little review for you all. Let's start with some information about the company Umbrado themselves and then we'll do an unboxing and see what they sent us. This company has been around just about as long as I have. I was born in 89 and they were formed in 1991. They have six different divisions of outdoor gear with truck and SUV air mattresses being one of those. This air mattress that they sent me is designed to fit a full size five and a half foot truck bed. Uh, they also make it in a six and a half foot size. But if you have a Tacoma or a Ranger or a midsize pickup, then these are too wide. This air mattress comes in six different colors, blue, beige, gray, and purple, red, and green. The top of the mattress is made with a soft flocking material and the bottom is made from an extra thick Oxford fabric with extra durable, environmentally safe PVC. The website says that it'll hold up to 600 pounds with enough room for probably two, two and a half people on there. If you see my other videos, you know that I truck camp out of my soft topper quite a bit and I have my whole elaborate setup and my gear and everything. Where I think this will probably come in most handy is when I truck camp with my wife to give us full uh, bed space back here on a pretty comfortable surface. So let's open it up and see what they sent us. So inside the box here, it looks like they've given us a 12 volt air pump, the air mattress itself, a carrying case, and a repair kit. Looking at the instructions here, it looks like they cover a one year warranty on the for failure of the pump, seams, or the valve. It's definitely a plus that they include a little air pump in here. Just a little guy. Now it is a 12 volt that runs off a cigarette lighter. Looking at the reviews online, it seems that most of the negative comments were about the pump, that it wasn't a long enough cord to run from the truck, to come to the back of the truck, to inflate the air mattress. So they had to inflate the air mattress outside and then put it into the truck, which isn't a huge deal. But nowadays, most everybody has a battery pack. So I've got this little Jackery here, it has a little 12 volt cigarette lighter on there. So what I'm gonna do is just use the little battery bank instead of plugging it into the truck. So let's unfold this here. Well, it looks like they've given us a couple of those inflatable pillows as well. We'll inflate these and see how they do. I've never been a fan of inflatable pillows. I went with the gray color. They said that was their most popular. And if you've seen my other videos, you know that I do uh, that one inch gym foam interlocking pieces in the back of the truck. That's usually what I use when I'm sleeping back here. So I'm just gonna leave that down underneath the air mattress. that into place. So we'll plug this into the Jackery here. We've got airflow. Sounds pretty powerful. Has three different adapter sizes here. Middle one seems to be the right size. We'll do a little timer here to see how long this takes. It takes about six and a half, seven minutes to get it set up, but that's an easy fix. If you want to get a different air pump or just wait it out, it's not that bad. It does have that nice seal on the inside, so air's not coming out even though I haven't closed the cap yet, but it fits in there nicely. Let's see if we can close the tailgate. Not too bad, the tailgate closes up all right. Let's do some official measurements here. So the length there is measuring right about 66 inches, so five and a half feet. About 59 inches wide, just under five feet. And about nine and a half inches thick. Let's get in there and see how it feels. This material on top is really soft. That's pretty nice. It's got those nice ribs in there. So if you're a side sleeper like me, it kind of just hugs you pretty well. That's pretty comfortable. 
I definitely would do something like this. This is like a cot organizer that you can keep on the side so you can organize a few of your things. There is a little bit of room around the edges, but it hugs that wheel well pretty nicely. And my wife is pretty short, so I think we could fit both of us back here and still sleep with that tailgate up. Now it's important not to over inflate your air mattress. I have this one probably at 80% right now. Uh, it's got a little bit of give to it, but when I lay my full body on there, it's really nice. And just be aware of over the first couple days with the new air mattress, there's always a little bit of give that happens there. But overall, so far, I'm really impressed. You can tell that the bottom has a thicker layer on there. Like I said, I like to put it on those foam gym mats anyways, but I don't, I'm not worried about puncture or, or ripping anything through there. It's definitely more durable than a traditional air mattress. Now the real test here is gonna be having my wife get on here cause she's the queen of comfort. I can sleep on anything, uh, but she's a little bit more picky when it comes to our sleeping setup when we're camping. So let me grab my wife and have her jump on here and see what she thinks. Pillows? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't have it inflated all the way, but once you lay down, it feels pretty good. Scoot all the way up to the top. It's perfect height for me. I say, hold on. <laughs> so she could sleep in there fully extended. <laughs> Is it comfy? Yeah. Could you sleep on that? Yeah. It's nice and soft. Yeah, the top is pretty soft. It fits really good in the, with the wheel well. Yeah, the cutout is nice. The pillows, I mean, it's pretty small, but <laughs> it's a cute touch. Do you, I, I don't ever think those pillows are very comfortable. This pillow, Could, maybe for puppies. For Oh, it's a puppy pillow? Yeah. Could you sleep on that pillow? I don't think I could sleep on the pillow. <laughs> but I could definitely sleep on the mattress. The mattress? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you can definitely fit two people on here for sure. Yeah, it says it says up to 600 pounds. But if you and I... Let's see, yeah, what is it like when you uh, hop in here? So I just have to be able to put my feet... Sideways? Sideways. And, the, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but we could still fold the tailgate up like that. I just would have to... We'd have to cuddle. Yeah. Yeah, you're definitely short. <laughs> <laughs> so, so far, I really like the quality of the air mattress. I really like the materials. Um, it's very soft, comfortable to lay on top of there. The length and the size and the cutouts around the wheel well are perfect for a full size pickup. This is an F-150. I don't think we can do a, an honest review of an air mattress and not actually sleep on it. So. Um, my little boy, we just bought him his first sleeping bag yesterday. He's really excited to go camping. We set up the tent in the backyard. We're gonna do a little trial run for him tonight. So it's a good opportunity for my wife and I to take this air mattress and sleep on it tonight. And that's one of the nice things about doing an air mattress for your truck camper setup is it's not just for truck camping. You can take this out. You got guests coming over, family, or the kids want to do a movie night or something out in the living room and you can blow this air mattress up. So you're not limited to just using it in the truck. Uh, has those cutouts around the wheel wells, which are nice, but you can use this uh, in a lot of different situations. So we're going to take this um, and set it up in the tent in the backyard and try it out tonight. Okay, more than enough room on there for two people. Got the two sleeping bags side by side. Not a lot of overlay there. Looks good. So we're gonna get settled in here and get ready for bed. We'll see y'all in the morning. Well, everyone, we made it through the night. We actually slept really well. I'm pleasantly surprised with how comfortable this air mattress is. My little guy was having a hard time settling down. You know, first time sleeping outside, first time sleeping in the tent. Uh, so he actually ended up in the middle of my wife and I for most of the night. My usual complaint with sleeping on an air mattress is that it loses pressure during the night. Um, and my wife being half the size that I am, she sleeps great because she stays up and then my butt ends up on the floor. And that didn't happen at all. This didn't lose air pressure. It's still just as inflated as it was yesterday when I filled it up in the truck. As far as comfort and functionality, everything, I'm really impressed with it. This is definitely really good quality. It's made of, of thicker materials. You're not gonna worry about puncturing that bottom or, or you know the sides when you're taking it out camping. So uh, overall, I'm really happy with it. We did try sleeping on the pillows a little bit. It's probably just 
personal preference, but I don't find these things to be that comfortable. But I haven't found any inflatable pillow that I find to be comfortable. So that's nothing against the pillow or the company by any means. It's just I've never felt like I get a good night's sleep or find any really good comfort with these. I'm going to deflate it now. It comes with that carrying bag, so we'll see how easily it, we can roll it up and put it into that carrying bag. There we go. That storage bag's pretty nice too. That's made from that thicker material as well. You can tell that's not gonna break down on you. For car camping, SUV camping, truck camping, this is great. Well guys, uh, honestly, this is a great truck air mattress. I've been really impressed with the whole experience from the company. They're very responsive and kind. When they shipped it to me, it only took a day to get here, so the shipping was very quick. And the quality is, is top notch. You know, at the price point that it is, this is a really good deal. If you go look at their website, they have different mattresses. If you're in an SUV or a car, you can kind of fit whatever camping situation you're looking for. If this is the route that you're gonna go with a truck air mattress, then definitely check out Umbrado. Their website will be posted down in the description. They hooked it up with a discount code for you all too. So 10 Trags Travels. Uh, I'll put that down in the description as well. If you go to their website, that'll save you 10% of their air mattresses. So a huge thank you to Umbrado for sending this to me to try out. And thank you to all of you for stopping by. Until the next video, everybody, be safe. Nothing but love and respect. We'll see you next time.